Wow, this is a wild one, folks. During a congressional hearing on government censorship, Democrats actually tried to censor one of the invited witnesses, RFK Jr., using their usual go-to excuse that he's a racist conspiracy theorist. I'd like to raise a point of order. General lady, state a point of order. Point of order, pursuant to House Rule 11, Clause 2, which Mr. Kennedy is violative of, I move that we remove into executive session because Mr. Kennedy has repeatedly made despicable anti-Semitic and anti-Asian comments as recently as last week. Rule 11, Clause 2 says, whenever it is asserted by a member of the committee that the evidence or testimony at a hearing may tend to defame, degrade, or incriminate any person, or it is asserted by a witness that the evidence or testimony that the witness would give at a hearing may tend to defame, degrade, or incriminate the witness, and it goes on. Mr. Kennedy, uh, among many other things, has said, I know a lot now about bioweapons. We put out hundreds of millions of dollars in, into ethnically targeted microbes. The Chinese have done the same thing. In fact, COVID-19, there is an argument that it is ethnically targeted. COVID-19 attacks certain races disproportionately. The races that are most immune to COVID-19 are- a lady making a motion or a speech? I, and I've made a motion to move into executive session because Mr. Mr. Kennedy's testimony- Mr. Chairman, I move to table the motion. Gentleman from Kentucky has moved to table. Mr. Mr. The, Chairman, I ask for a roll call vote on the, on the motion to table. Well, let me ask the question. The question is on the motion to table. The gentlelady has asked for a roll call vote. The clerk will, will have to step back for a second. The clerk will have to come in. We'll call the roll on the motion to table, and then we can get back to testimony. I think the witnesses can sit in the chairs sitting behind. Um, I'll leave that up to the clerks. If the clerks are comfortable with that, Yeah, why don't we do that? Maybe we can go right down here. Mr. 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 Chairman, point of order. Gentleman from Louisiana. Is it the custom of this committee to censor viewpoints that we disagree with from witnesses? Mr. Chairman, I have, a, not motion. A, point of I have order. a motion on the table. There's a motion and the vote's been called. Into executive executive House session. We're waiting for, for, we're waiting for the clerks. Is violative of Rule 11, Clause 2. Waiting for the clerks. Okay. Clerk will call the roll. Mr. Jordan. Yes. Mr. Jordan votes yes. Mr. Issa. Mr. Massey? Yes, to not censor. Mr. Massey votes yes. Mr. Stewart? Yes. Mr. Stewart votes yes. Mr. S Ms. Stefanik? Yes. Ms. Stefanik votes yes. Mr. Gates? Mr. Johnson of Louisiana? Yes. Mr. Johnson of Louisiana votes yes. Mr. Armstrong? Yes. Mr. Armstrong votes yes. Mr. Subi? Mr. Bishop? Yes. Mr. Bishop votes yes. Ms. Kamak? Yes. Ms. Kamak votes yes. Ms. Hageman? Yes. Ms. Hageman votes yes. Ms. Poscott. No, I want to follow the rules that the Republicans made at the beginning of this uh, conference with these House rules, so no. Ms. Poscott votes no. Mr. Lynch? No. Mr. Lynch votes no. Ms. Sanchez? No, because Ms. it's violative of the rules. Ms. Sanchez votes no. Ms. Wasserman Schultz? No to allowing a witness to degrade and this degrade is not others time. and violate the rules and not have his testimony and degradation and amplified rather than given an executive session. Ms. Wasserman Schultz votes no. Mr. Connolly? No to the Soviet Ms. Politburo. Mr. Connolly votes no. Mr. Garamendi? No. Mr. Garamendi votes no. Mr. Allred? Ms. Garcia? No. Ms. Garcia votes no. Mr. Goldman? No to hate speech. Mr. Goldman votes no. Jeez. Mr. Gates? Yes. Mr. Gates? Aye. Mr. Gates votes aye. Clerk will report. Mr. Chairman, there are 10 ayes and eight noes. Uh, the, the motion to table is agreed to.